Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're returning, if you're new, make sure you subscribe if you resonate with me. This is a brand new channel. So we are gonna go ahead and, oh, before I start, for those of you who are interested in a free reading, uh, starting tonight, this is Tuesday, starting tonight at 6.30 Pacific Standard Time, uh, I will be doing free readings on my Facebook Live. So find me on Facebook, uh, like Girl Tarot, and be on the lookout for that every Tuesday. Okay? So this will be good for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Pisces, or if you are cross-watching, dealing with the Pisces, some of these messages might actually be for you because it's a general. But if you are interested in something specific to your energy, uh, you can book a personal reading and that information will be down below. Okay? So, Pisces, what's going on with the person? What do they not want you to know? What are they hiding from you? What do they not want you to know? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Pisces. Pisces, Pisces. I see that you are dealing with a soulmate, so um, they could, they don't want you to know how strong their feelings are towards you, that they feel like you're their soulmate even. Let's see, what else? What do they not want Pisces to know? What does this person not want Pisces to know? Yeah, you could be in separation from this person, but they want to come back to you. That's what they don't want you to know. They don't want you to know. Okay, somebody had a hard time opening up to this connection. Okay, somebody had a hard, like they were very guarded here, I'm getting. Let's see, what else? Do they not want you to know? Pisces. What does this person not want Pisces to know? What does this person not want Pisces to know? Yeah, they had a lot of fear when it came to you in this connection. Or this could be you. Ooh, this is a twin flame. Who just got this? A uh, Taurus just got this. You could be dealing with a Taurus, um, but they don't want you to know that they feel this connection. Um, they could be really involved in their career and focusing on their money right now. Uh, you could know this person from work even. You could have met them at work. Uh, yeah, they, <laughs> what I'm getting is like, some, some of them may be trying to like manifest you back in their life. They could be like, they could pray for you and you, they don't want you to know this. They have a lot of regrets. They don't want you to know this. They have a lot of regrets that you guys are in separation. I feel like they weren't, uh, they weren't willing to compromise with you. And they, they're trying to go within to get answers or they're trying to, um, seek advice or get answers, um, because they do have a lot of regrets because they are not happy about you guys being in separation. They're trying to be patient. They don't want you to know. They're trying to trust that um, things will come together when they're supposed to come together. Yeah, you guys could have different belief systems or like different religions even. I'm getting, yeah, this person, there's a lot of fear, fear-based. Like this person has a lot of fear and regrets about the way that they treated you, about the way that um, things have transpired between the two of you. The reason why you guys are in separation, I just feel like, yeah, there's a lot of regrets here. Um, yeah, there's, okay. They Somebody here doesn't want to get hurt again. So... Um, yeah, this person feels sorry for hurting your feelings, but they're really guarded. They don't want to get hurt. They miss you. They feel like you have a beautiful smile. This person really likes your laugh. Uh, they feel like your laugh, something that has to do with, this might be for a specific person, but, um, like you might have a very unique laugh that they comment on or something like that. This person uh, may ask mutual friends about you to see what you're up to, to see how you're doing, check in on you, but they don't want you to know that. They don't want you to know that they feel like they would be rejected uh, or that they don't know if you still want them. Some of them feel like you're too good for them, I'm hearing. Yeah, they, they know that you've been together in past lives because this is a very strong connection, this twin flame connection. Yeah. So to this person, they could come off very um, 
detached and like hard and like um have this very macho uh, masculine type energy or if, even if you're a, a female that I'm reading for you could f come off very like guarded and like independent like you don't need anybody that type of energy but whoever this person feels like you could see through that and you saw them for who they truly are so they know that you like you saw them for who they truly are but they want to let their guard down with you because they feel like no one gives them the love that you did. They feel like you love them more than anyone could. They feel like they didn't appreciate that until you were gone. They, yeah, they didn't appreciate that until you were gone. You probably gave more to this connection than they did. And now they're realizing that you could be going with an Aries. Now they're realizing that and they have a lot of regrets. A lot of regrets and they want to come back together with you but they don't want you to know that they're planning on coming back together with you they don't want you to know that actually you know what for you guys I'm gonna go ahead and use this deck here I haven't used this yet today so I'm gonna shuffle for a few minutes but um this person doesn't want you to know that yeah they fear being rejected by you if they contact you they don't know if you still want them this person feels like you're too good for them in a lot of ways um they miss you yeah, they're ready for to open up to you and they want you to see they want you to know how much they truly appreciate you and everything that you've done for them that you're very genuine i'm getting um so yeah what i'm getting is like they feel like it's really hard for to find um like genuine people which it is and they feel like you were genuine and maybe they took advantage of that or didn't see it for what it was when you were um together because they were too busy busy trying to be guarded yeah they want to bring balance back into the situation bring be fair they think about this all the time they don't want you to know that could be dealing with a libra yeah see nine of swords they think about this they they think about this that gives them anxiety it stresses them out they could have a hard time sleeping at night even i'm also getting that they could be um dreaming about you too could be dealing with an earth sign uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But this person's been doing a lot of work on themselves. They want to offer you something stable. Ooh. Yeah, they want to come forward and offer you an apology here. Yeah, so they're... Yeah, this person is doing a lot of work on themselves. Um, They could be going within and trying to uh, conquer some demons here. Even with the devil, this could be addictions, right? So this person is really trying to focus on themselves so they can come forward to you and offer you something stable. I feel like, but there's some work that they still need to do. They have a lot of temptations. Okay, so they could be at a distance from you and you could be not in communication at this time or if you are, it's very little. But I do see a uh, distance between the two of you. Yeah, so some of them could even, I have to say this because this message is here, some of them, for some of you, could be like incarcerated or going to some type of institute here um, in order to work on themselves, but there is forward movement coming. They want to create something new with you. Some of them are really trying to manifest you back into their lives, but they don't want you to know this. I feel like for you guys to come together, it's going to take more time than what you anticipated or they anticipated. Okay, things are moving slow. Slow and steady is what I just heard. You could be dealing with a Taurus. Aries is here, Cancer is here as well. Um, air, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay, so somebody tries to come off very like emotionally detached, I'm getting. Um, yeah, somebody really fears the unknown, right? I feel like you and this person have a very like intuitive connection though. Like you guys can, you guys both feel this. Yeah, somebody's really upset about the way things ended. Mm -hmm. Somebody's really trying to juggle, like balance things out, get themselves grounded and um, take care of themselves in order for you guys to come back together. Okay, so um, 
this is what I'm seeing. If you resonate, make sure you subscribe. Leave me a comment. I love reading your guys' comments. And um, I'll talk to you guys soon.